What's good, y'all? GVO Juju back with another video for you. Make sure y'all like, share, comment, and subscribe. You feel me? Help this channel grow so we can reach the people it needs to. If you have any video suggestions, leave them in the comments below. Or if you have any personal questions you're wondering about, you can just add my socials. I'll leave them all in the description. So today I just want to be in and out. I have something to do right now. So, and I just want to get y'all a quick little video. You feel me? Before I go. So what I really want you to understand is how important patience is. You feel me? Patience is a form of wisdom. When you understand that things take time, people take time, and that you have to have that patience and that stillness within you in order to truly find peace, you'll find that your life will just become so much more high vibrational. You feel me? So what, I, what you need to understand about patience is this. When it comes to people, a lot of people, at times we allow people to trigger us. We allow people to set us off and get into vibrations that we don't want to. Simply because we don't understand that everybody is doing the best they can with the knowledge that they have. You feel me? So you can't rush somebody else into being this knowledgeable. You feel me? When you are on a highly when you're on a highly awoken path, when you are spiritual and you have knowledge about everything, you have to realize that not many people are going to understand the things you understand. You feel me? Not many people are going to be on that same mental or consciousness level that you are at. So, understand that you can't force somebody to know the things you know. You can't force the knowledge that you have. You can't force your ideas on somebody else. You have to understand that that person is operating at a level that they believe is right for them at the moment. You have to understand that you have to, you have to be patient. You can't, you can't rush people into knowing everything that you know. You feel me? Everybody is at their own consciousness level at a certain time for a certain reason. You feel me? So don't judge somebody else just because they're not on the consciousness level you are. Don't allow other people that aren't on the level you are to bring you down to theirs. Don't try to implement your knowledge. Don't try to just force your beliefs and ideals on somebody just because you know in your idea, in your reality, that it is truth. People have different lives. People live differently. People have different ideals for different reasons. You feel me? So understand that that person that you are communicating with, if they are hurting you in a way, they might not even know it. You feel me? So understand that never, nothing anybody else says to you or about you is personal. Understand that the way people treat others is just a reflection of how they treat themselves. So when somebody talks shit about you, when somebody is really trying to just bring you down, understand that if they're talking to you like that, they're talking to themselves a lot worse than that. You feel me? And allow yourself to... Be calm in that moment. Allow yourself to understand that this isn't personal. What they're saying about me is not truly about me. That is just their, that is just how they view me. That is just how I am in their perception. And understand that your perception is stronger than anybody else's. Your perception of yourself is stronger than anybody else's perception of you. You feel me? The next thing about patience is this. When it comes to manifesting things... A lot of us have this time set. A lot of us have a lot of desires and wants that we want to manifest into this reality, right? And that's only normal because you understand that the universe is truly abundant and you are the universe, so you deserve all the abundance. That is the right mindset. But understand this. When you are trying to make something rush, when you're trying to rush a manifestation, when you are constantly thinking about it, when you are constantly, oh, is this it, is this it? When you are constantly focusing your energy on that manifestation, you are trying to rush it because whether you know it or not, you subconsciously have a fear that it may not come true. When you fear that something is not coming true, when you fear, when you are trying to rush something to happen, you are in your ego. Because understand this, time is not real. Time is something that was constructed in order to something something that was constructed by this ego in order to calculate certain measurements. You feel me? Time is something that only our egos feel. Because understand on a spiritual level, 
Our spirits are infinite. Our spirits never die. We are immortal. So there is no time for us in our true nature. So when you realize that you are trying to rush something, when you realize that you are trying to make something happen right now, understand that that's not your higher self. That is your ego trying to rush something out of fear that it may not manifest, out of fear that maybe that it is out of impatience, you feel me? Because you want something right now because your ego only understands right now. Your ego un only understands what it has and what it doesn't have. If your, ego, your ego doesn't understand that you are truly infinite and you are truly abundant because you are the universe in spirit. You feel me? So whenever you have a manifestation, whenever you have something you want to come to fruition, set that intention. Put emotions towards that intention. And the strongest thing to be able to do in order for that manifestation to truly come to fruition is once you put those once you put that intention out there just let it go just understand that the universe has responded to it the universe understands that it wants it you feel me and just let go because when you are attached to something that means you have a fear that is going to run away from you if you are if you are constantly chasing something when you chase something, what happens? If you're chasing something, that means something that you want is running away from you. If you chase a rat or you chase a dog, it's going to run away from you. So when you're constantly chasing this manifestation or this dream that you have and you're not being patient with it, understand that if you are chasing something, that means you think it's running away from you. And that is not the truth. Understand that you are truly abundant. You have the ability to create everything you want. And everything that you want is already here. If you feel something, if you dream something, understand that it's already here. Because whatever you want can come to fruition. You feel me? Understand that. Understand that with patience. Understand that once you truly implement patience into your life, you will understand how everything is just a reflection of... Everything in your outer world is just a reflection of your inner world. When you have patience with somebody else and you have patience with yourself, that is the most important thing. Have patience with yourself. Don't blame yourself for not being at a certain point that you want to be in the future or that you are at right now. You feel me? Understand that you are at exactly where you are supposed to be at this moment. Have that patience with yourself and understand that I am at exactly where I need to be at. And I have everything I need to have right now. And once you start to realize that, once you start to implement that into your mind, you understand how everything in your outer reality will start to map out into everything you want. Because when you have that, when you have that level of patience and understanding that even though I don't see it with these two eyes, it's already here. When you understand that I can't, control every single thing outside of myself and that people only treat me how they treat themselves you understand how everything is a reflection of your inner world is truly a reflection your outer world i mean let me let me let me gather my thoughts you start to understand how everything in your outer world is truly a reflection of your inner world because when you have patience you allow the universe to flow you don't have this resistance because when you are constantly attached to something, when you are constantly thinking about something, you create this resistance energy towards you. And the universe operates best when you allow it to flow through you. And once you start to allow the universe to flow through you, you everything in your outer reality will become what you truly want it to become. You feel me? So that's really the quick message I have for y'all, man. Be patient. Understand that People treat you only the way they treat themselves. And people, the way people act is how, where they're supposed to be acting. You feel me? Understand that everybody's at a different level in their evolution. And not everybody can be at the same level you are. So be patient with them. Also be patient with yourself. Understand that you are where you are supposed to be at. Because right now, you are gaining the skills. You are gaining the knowledge in order to get to where you want to be. So have that patience with yourself to say that, okay... I have to intake and I have to be grateful for everything that's around me because everything that's around me right now is in order to get me to that place I want to be. And also be patient with your manifestations. Understand that everything that you want and everything that you have in your mind, every thought that you have is a reality. When you are traveling, 
when you are thinking of that place that you want to be at you are time traveling into the future so if you understand that every single thought that i have every single manifestation that i put out is already here it will start to create itself into its your own reality because you are now at flow understand that and with patience your life will just reach a place that has never been you feel me so that's a quick message i want to get to y'all today man i love you all be patient with yourself understand that you are where you are supposed to be and everybody else is at where they are supposed to be at in their own unique journey i love y'all man if y'all have any video suggestions leave it in the comment below remember if you have any questions or you want to hit me up about anything just add my socials. I'll leave them all in the description. I love y'all, man. GVO Juju signing out.